My name is Ricarda Bauenfeind and I'm a rider for the Kenyan SRAM racing team. About our trip to Vienna. When I was a child, we always did a camping trip in our holidays. So we went by bike and with our tent, for example, from Eichstätt to Vienna or from Eichstätt to Verona. For me and my brother, it was always such a great experience. And yeah, every year we were looking forward to it. So my first race was time train in Ip. There I was the only starter, so it was also my first win. But yeah, it was the start of my cycling future. Ooh, I did. <laughs> so this is the castle of Eichstätt. It's called the Willibaldsburg. And this is a brewery. It's called Hofmühl. But my dad doesn't like the beer. Ah oh, yeah, and this is our small beach. I grew up here in Eichstätt and it's a small city, but I would say, yeah, it's a beautiful area for cycling, but also for other activities. Maybe we find some eggs. Hey. They are sitting on there. Coming home to yeah, this beautiful place is always the best place for recovering and some family time. I'm quite an ambitious person, um, sometimes open-minded, but sometimes quite shy. Um, I always want to give 100%. Yeah, I always say your mind is stronger than your body, and I would say this helps me a lot also during races. At the end of 2019, to yeah, do less racing and focus more on studying. I lost a bit of fun and of course I enjoyed racing, but at the same time I was also super nervous and afraid of failing or something. Then I started to study to become a teacher. When I lived in Munich and did my study, I started to do the Swift Academy workouts. It was more just for fun and also a friend of mine did it, so we decided to continue and just do the workouts. Both of us ended up in the top 20 and when I received the message, I was like, no, I don't want to do this. <laughs> it wasn't my goal, so... Then I heard from the Kenyan SRAM generation team and I thought, okay, maybe this is a good opportunity for me because the focus was more on developing and learning and not putting too much pressure on the riders. In the end, it turned out to be, I would say, the best decision. So being now in the Women's World Tour team is yeah just amazing and it shows me that I took the right way and also sometimes one step back is two steps forwards. Now I still I still have to learn a lot but I can learn a lot from my teammates on and off the bike and yeah everyone is supporting and encouraged me. Since there is a Tour de France Femme avec Swift, I would say the dream or the goal of every rider is to be on the start line one day. So this is definitely my biggest goal for the future. Um, and if I could be on the start line already this year, yeah, it's, it would be amazing. But I still want to continue developing myself and I think I have to learn a lot still. So I want to become a better rider and 
continue learning and developing myself.